Hello there, I am Giant Girl with more Earthbound. In the last part, we took on Everdread as a little boss battle, or a boss battle, and then we met Apple Kid. And he told us to uh, go find Paula. She's, you know, kidnapped, obviously, because we've heard from other sources that she was kidnapped, and bring her back to the park, I guess, when we get to um, meet up with her, I guess. We kind of we have to go look for it, too, at the same time. Now, first to start off, I'm going to store a couple items. I didn't mean to fast forward there, but um, I'm going to store a couple items. So I need like eighteen dollars from my from like Chicago Express as a as a fee or um yeah fee I guess you'd say so eighteen dollars okay so now I have twenty dollars that's nice and what I want to do is I'm gonna call Chicago Express it'll be Tracy on the phone because she's working part time there not Marcus call again yeah I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to you know do Mac Pizza I meant to do Chicago Express. Okay, big bro. Yeah, it's me, Tracy. I'm working part time at the Exile Express. Pass. Pick up, please. Um, yeah, we'll send someone over to, to pick you up. And yeah, we store some items. Okay. So I think we just have to, you know, walk around a little bit. So we'll just do that, I guess. Oh, look, he's here already. Cool. Hey, this is Exile Express. Your delivery charge is eighteen dollars. You can cover the bill, right? Yes. What do I take? I can take up the three things. Okay. So let's see here. Um, for sale sign. Yes. Um. Cold remedy. And. That's about it for now. Yeah. Let me confirm. You want to store or take the for sale sign and cold remedy. Is that correct? Yes. Okay. Now we have more room in our um, goods section, so that's good. So we're actually gonna leave Tucson pretty much. Um, I mean, I, I know we only spent like two or three parts in this area, but or in this town, this city, I guess you could say, this area. But um, first, I want to show you if you go down south, there's actually a cave there with ghosts, and you can't proceed from there. I just want to show it off. But um, there's a different way you have to go in order to progress in the game, really. So I'm gonna make my way south first to show off that little um, block <laughs> that we have, I guess, that we have to deal with. Well, we can't deal with it now, I have to deal with it later. So that's good. Okay. Oh no, it's a hippie. We gotta face him, I guess, battle him. Why not? New, new age re retro hippie, I like that. Okay, cool. Oh, nice. I wanted to bash him twice. Nice. We got 160 experience points. Okay. I think I may have missed the present up there, but I'll have to go back for it. I kind of purposely ran into this hippie. My bad. <laughs> I was like, not thinking, like, I want to show off this one part that blocks us from that area, but I'm getting sidetracked apparently. 160 experience points, and that's good level 4, oh, it is now 14. Fun's level went up by 1, Guts went up by 1, uh, Vitality went up by 1, Maximum HP went up by 12, Maximum PP went up by 1, and we see the power of, paral power of Paralysis Alpha. That's pretty cool. And now, okay, good, the cranky way is just going the other way. I think there's a present up here, but I could be wrong. Okay, it's something wrong, probably. Come on. No, he's closing in. Final battle, you, jeez. Because I know that present for sure is a skip sandwich. I had a failed recording earlier. So, yeah. That's how I know it. <laughs> Come on. Okay, teddy bear. Okay, cool. Now let's get rid of the cranky lady. See, so she gives 200 experience points. Yeah, I thought. Yeah, I know that because I've seen the cranky lady beat her before. Okay, ah! There's so many of them. Here is, um. Sorry, my emulator kind of froze there for a second. The annoying old P, P party man. Okay. Okay, cool. Okay, just just come on. One more bash should do it. Okay, smash. Awesome. Smash. Nice. Okay, right one X. Good, you're getting away from me. Good. Okay. Okay, you know, the present the skip sandwich just takes it. Okay, I want to. I want to use that now, and hopefully I can get rid of this, get away from this, um, person. But then again, if I, like, yeah, I couldn't have got away. I don't want to use waste my skip sandwich right there, yeah. 
I mean, oh my gosh, I just want to show off this one area, smash attack, okay, yeah, you, um, yeah, cool, nice, okay, no, are you kidding me, jeez, I just want to get to this one area, oh my gosh, you jerk, shopping bags hurt, you know, Didn't work on the tape, very good. Thank you. Okay, for the... Just crying out loud, man. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, new age retro hippie. Yeah, it's just too bash on you should be done. You confuse me because you're using a to um, brush your teeth and your teeth are so white. Ness is confused, apparently. So, okay, that's cool, I guess. You won! Okay. Good. That's good to know. And finally, if we talk to this guy, well, I can just talk to this guy. Nope, I want to talk to him. I mean, it's just a hunch, but I think the ghosts in the cave and the tunnel and the tunnel don't like anything upbeat and cheerful. When I was driving in the tunnel, it was, I was playing some groovy tunes and the ghosts moved uh, slower. I think the ghost can't stand anything positive. Okay, so if you um go in the cl in the tunnel, it's like one of the little things like when you're driving down the highway and you go through this little tunnel. It's kind of like that kind of thing. Woo woo woo! Go back, go back. Okay, so um I think you have to fight them eventually if you don't keep on going back. So I'm just gonna listen to them go back. That means you can't really go past this point to progress in the game. You have to go a different way. Now I'm gonna use my skip sandwich. Because I want to just speed through this part, because this is and get not really... It restores HP there, and I can like walk fast, like or run, move faster, I should say. It's like the running shoes in Pokemon. Gosh dang it. Yeah, I'm not running all of them, nice. No, no, I'm not running all of them. No! Are you kidding me? I don't want to face any more enemies right now. Jeez. Okay, fine. Three bashers should do it. One more bash, hopefully. Yeah, there we go. I was right, yay. Okay, now we have to face another one because he's right there. Okay, never mind. We can just snoop past him like that. How we psyched him out. Well, actually, we just ran in one direction that confused him and didn't follow us, basically. Yeah, that's what he did. That's pretty cool. I'm not going to bother with that cranky lady over there. Okay, so to go the right way, you want to go the way I'm going and just go east of Tucson. And hopefully I don't run into any enemies. And oh, I got mushroom. Um, okay, yeah. Ooh, butterfly. But it's like right in the middle of those mushrooms. Do I really want to get it? I'll skip out on it. I don't want to run into any more enemies. Okay, whatever. Let's just go in the... Yeah. Oh, I didn't read the sign. Let me read the sign real quick. Okay. Uh, peaceful vest valley ahead. Proceed through cave. Okay. Cool. Nice. So of course there's enemies in here, so we have to, you know, uh, battle them. I'm gonna use PSI Rockin'. Ah, oh, I became a Pluff, okay. Pluff, yeah. So that teddy bear did last me a long while though, so in my opinion at least. Then we're going, okay, fine, I'll bash the mushroom. Yeah, thank you. Okay, we got 320 experience, okay, cool. So I think there's another little cave area, but then there's the valley when we come out of this. Oh my gosh, there's four of them, and I have to deal with two of them at a time, it looks like. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to use PSI Rock, and I, mean, I, only, I can only use it twice, because um, I only have 21 HP, PP, so then it takes 10 PP. Oh my gosh, no, not PSI Magnet. Smash! Oh my gosh, no, I can't even use PSI Rock now. Sucks. Smash, ooh. Wipe up. Yeah, maxed out. Okay, of course. Come on. I just want to beat this mobile sprout and get along, get a, get on with my day, I guess. I don't know. Okay, we got 399 experience. Okay, cool. I should eat a hamburger, actually. Okay, I'm going to wait for my... HP to get all the way up to 90, I guess, because that's 48. Whoa! Who did, did I make a beat you then? Nope, of course not. 
There we go. There we go again. There goes the one, okay. Okay, just 10 HP against Ness, okay. That's cool. PSI Magnet, oh, come on. Now I can't even use the Life Up Alpha. Because it takes 5 PP. Yay, we're level 15 now. 266, I believe, experience points. Um, offense went up by 1, IQ went up by 1, maximum HP went up by 2, uh, maximum PP went up by 4. Nice. Yeah. So I could use Alpha, PSI Life Up Alpha if I could. Now, actually, that's 70 PP. Okay. Uh, hmm, da 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 dee dum dum I'm hunting for mushrooms. I'm going to collect a ton. But you picked a right good, sp good spot because there's already four right there on the ground. So right here should be- okay, I'll talk to this mole guy. I'm not an enemy, I'm just a regular mole. Would you like me to know- would you like to know about how to survive battles? I already know, it's like Mega Man really, if you- so just as long as you use the healing item before your HP uh, scrolls down all the way to zero, you'll be fine. I think that's what he's gonna share to us. Now this is an enemy I'm gonna fight actually, but it's like the closest thing that an alien enemy in this game, other than Starman Jr. which we saw really early on this let's play, like at the maybe first or second part actually, second part I think. So yeah. Let's bash this. I think, like, for some reason I have very uh, not good luck on, um, actually bashing the UFOs. Because, like, in my failed recording, I was always missing, or Ness was always missing. But right now, he's not missing at all. Ha ha ha. And the UFO is destroyed, yay. Okay. So that was uh, easier than this time than last time, for me at least. If you go up here, you'll see that this bridge is, um, broken right here. And there's a... Uh, a guy on the other side, so we can't really go that way because the bridge is, you know, out. I guess you could say. So, what we want to do is go up here, but then if we go up here, we see this pencil statue. Let's check it. Uh, for some weird reason, a pencil shaped iron statue is blocking the path. So we can't go that way, so we have to actually backtrack. And, um, uh, we'll have to figure out what happens there. So, to, yeah, just basically for, for the rest of the game, you want to just backtrack all the way out of the, um, Restful Peace Valley, whatever. Oh, there's another UFO. Okay. Oh man, I was trying to avoid it, but then it back attacked me, so that's not good. Okay. A beam. Okay, that's cool. Not really, actually. Oh, I got. Oh man, that's got a cold. I wish I had the um, cold remedy now, but like. Oh my gosh, I might die. I guess I might die. Wow, I'm in a pickle right now. Because, well, basically it would just take me back to my uh, safe point, but still. I don't want to die in this battle. Uh, can we use a hamburger? So, nope, okay. I'll sneeze. Oh, I did. F okay, dang it. Whoa, okay. I got lucky there. Let's try to bash this thing, though. I thought I was gonna. Ness was gonna go bye bye. Okay, the level 50. Okay, good. I won. I thought I was gonna die there. Or Ness was gonna die. Or collapse, I mean. In that case. So, what I wanna do, since I have a cold, I'm gonna use PSI healing. I got out of this cold. Okay, since I don't have a cold remedy on me, I had a cold remedy at the beginning of this part, but I stored it away. So, because I was hoping that I could just use, you know, healing alpha for only 5 PP. And it actually worked out because I was able to use healing alpha. Dang it, I don't, ha I don't have any. Hamburgers, or I don't have enough PP for um, to do life up alpha, which kind of stinks. So I'm gonna have to just try to just take this mobile sprout in two in two um, bashes, I guess you could say. And it should be do it should be do it should be done. Yeah, there we go. It's done. We did it. Okay, I think it was 138 experience that said that we caught. Okay, yes, good. There's nothing. There's no enemies in this last section either. In this last section. Okay, you hear the phone ringing. Receiver phone. Hey, hello, this is Apple Kid. I've just finished working on this great invention. Get over here as fast as you can. This thing is so cool. See you soon. Slam beep. Okay, so let's make our way back. Gosh dang it! Oh my gosh, no! <sighs> if I die because of this, it didn't sprout because you. Okay, you waited seeds, but they didn't sprout. I have no food items. I'm pretty sure. And you gotta take the last of my- well, it doesn't matter really. I thought they'd do that because I couldn't really use any of my, um, PSI anyway. Begin to feel strange. Okay, that's like the mushroom thing. Um, yeah, I don't have any food items. That's great. Let's just take out this rabbit and evil mushroom. 
Rainbow and Eevee Mushroom. Gosh, just leave me alone. Feel lucky, okay. Yeah. Whoa! I died. Her nest died. Dang it, it collapsed. Gosh, dang it. Oh, she's gonna teleport me to the hotel, I guess. Okay, I'm level 15 though. Okay, so it's good that I kind of got teleported here anyway, because I was trying to make my way back anyway. So that's good. I need a butterfly or something though. Okay, so we're we'll making our way to Apple Kid's house because he needs us to be there as soon as possible. So let's just do that. Hopefully, you can make a window butterfly soon so I can get some PP back. Oh wait, Apple Kid is actually at the um, park actually. Now that I mentioned it. Now that I remember. And then you might not see him at first when you first play in this game. Oh my gosh, a butterfly! Let's catch it. Let's catch it. Nice. There we go. Okay, cool. So, yeah, Apple Kid's actually right there in front of that tree. Let's talk to his mouse first. Um, I, I am a mouse. My master Apple Kid has been waiting for you. We started to nod off while waiting. Okay, cool. Let's talk to Apple Kid. I'm feeling really out of it because I've been working on working all night. But finally, the pencil eraser is ready. This machine will er eradicate all pencil-shaped figures in just one second. It's incredibly powerful. Just don't use it near a shop that sells pencils. However, over here, um, it's yours now. Cool. Ness got the pencil eraser. I, I, if I invent some other brilliant items, if I invent, if I invent some other brilliant item, I'll call you. Okay, that sounds cool. So yeah, we got the pencil eraser. Thank you. Yeah, Ness used the pencil eraser, but nothing happened. Okay. So yeah, we have to actually just on the statue of the pencil, so that's good. Let's go make our way. Um, I'm gonna cut the part right here though, cause I'm gonna um in the part right here. I have 20 PP. That's good. Okay, cool. Cause that by five. So yeah. Um, in the next part, we'll take on more of the um restless um um val valley east valley. Wait, can I even see? Oh, I don't have the map anymore, actually. Oh well. So this has been Giant Go again. This has been then my uh, this has been then my Earthbound Let's Play part. And next part we'll take on more of, you know, just do the pencil statue thing and explore that valley some more. So this has been Giant Go again. I would like to say goodbye and hope to see you guys next part of my Earthbound Let's Play.